Now, how could we change events of history? My best prediction, Arc Trooper 5s. Yep, I said it. Clone Arc Trooper 5 was the five, so was the only one who knew about the conspiracy. He was the only one who knew about Order 66. And Palpatine's altering plans of the galaxy. So, how do we fix it? Well, there is no fixing what can't be fixed. As a Jedi said, that the begun the Jedi War had, there was no way to fix it. But that doesn't mean we can't try. But that doesn't mean we can't try. But where do we begin? Well, I don't think we'll begin with Sif with Sifo Diaz. Because we're going to look at something different. When Ahsoka went to Mandalore, only her and Maul sensed Anakin's turn. Because Anakin and Maul were because Ahsoka and Maul were not connected to the Jedi nor the Sith. Now, I know what you're thinking. That, won't this sound exactly like the Star Wars? Won't this sound like CBR's video? Here's where it changes. Instead, Ahsoka has all the clones in her battalions and had her chips removed. Meaning that the 501st that were... The 501st that were still left on Coruscant would still be under the control of the inhibitor chip. Anakin has half of the 501st when Ahsoka has the other half. Meaning that Anakin doesn't have the element of surprise anymore. Jesse tells Ahsoka that they need to enter hyperspace and get back to Coruscant to stop their other brothers. Ahsoka agrees. She first patches in to, every, to any available Jedi she can. As half of the Jedi are on missions across the galaxy. As half of the Jedi Council is spread thin. But it's too late. Order 66 is ordered. Ahsoka's battalion wouldn't turn their guns on her. But across the galaxy, clones do. Ahsoka's message reaches half of them in time. But still, Kiani Mundi, Plo Koon, and Alea Secura would lose their lives. Actually, no. Only Plo... Only only Kiai Mundi would, as Plo Koon would, would move away from his, his clones once he, gets, once he gets the message from Ahsoka. He thanks little Ahsoka for saving his skin and fires two laser bullets in the back of his clone ship, causing before they fired for two missiles to hit their ships, exploding them and maybe even killing the pilots inside. This is bloody. Now, we know that Wolf already had his chip removed. So, he's not... So, he's not... So, he's not in danger. But it's too late. Ahsoka realizes that Maul was right. Palpatine was the one behind everything. He was behind all Padme's assassination attempts. He was behind everything.
Now, what about Anakin at this point? Would he still be... Anakin would still be turned. But with more Jedi waiting at the temple, him and his clones do not have the element of surprise anymore. They lost it. Instead of... Instead of... Instead of Anakin versus Obi-Wan, it's Master versus Apprentice. Ahsoka's already at the temple. She doesn't want to fight her master, but she has to. Padme's already given birth to Luke and Leia by this time, so she won't die in this timeline. Padme would rush to the temple with her children in her arms. Anakin would be surprised to see this. As Anakin fights with wanting to, to finish his assignment. Anakin de-ignites his lightsaber and puts it in, in, in on his belt. 